hey hey planner babes and welcome back to my channel it's Shonda of pretty face plans and it is time for another plan with me video today I'm planning for the upcoming week which is May 18th through the 24th and I will be doing this plan in my classic size vertical happy planner the wild style planner that I am redating up until July when the planner actually starts and yeah so these are my plans from last week I filled in most of these spaces I feel still have a couple of empty spaces and I did everything that's on here which is pretty good for me except wipe my teeth because I ran out of whitener so I have to get some of that that just reminds me I need to put that on my grocery list but I digress back to what's at focus here uh, I'm going to go ahead and pull the pages off of this just to give myself some more room real quick. And then I'm going to tell you about what I'm going to be using in this spread. Uh, decided to stick with my uh, Mayflowers theme. So I'm going to do another floral. And this will maybe, yeah, this will be the last one because the, no it's not. I still have some more days so next to the last one because I'm doing florals all of May um, these are the books I'm gonna be using I'm going to get out of this mom book it's an oldie but goodie but I have a birthday this week so I'm just gonna go in here because it has some black birthday stickers that I need I probably could have got them from somewhere else but that's the first book I thought of that had birthday stickers in it also going to be using fun florals for my florals this week the very first color story not color story story colorful boxes book I'm using this for some black boxes because my theme this week is going to be pink and black I have this alphabet book just because I'm going to use it just to do my month here I have <laughs> a lot of books this week. I have the dates and holidays just to get my date stickers. And finally, if I need to, I'll get a couple of quotes out of this book. Um, just black quotes to go in my pink and black spread. So those are the things I'm going to be using. Also going to go with some black and white polka dot or white with black polka dot washi tape this week to add some interest in there and so if you're interested in seeing what layout I come out with this week just stay tuned so what I'm going to do is go ahead and get started and come back and talk to you about how the spread turned out at the end so I will just work quietly with some music in the background and then come back so here we go
Okay guys, I think this is going to do it for the week. I am trying to decide if I want to add in any more florals. But I think I have enough. I think I can leave it like that and excuse me, this still be cute. So let's talk about what I did. Uh, you'll notice in the video that I took, I had a pink, more pinky colored floral right there. And when I looked at all of the other florals that I had in here, I noticed that it was just like a bright pink and these have a more reddish tone. So although I intended to have a hot pink and black and white spread, it turned into a more reddish and black and white spread with a few pops of green in there that are part of the florals. Also, I wanted to incorporate the washi tape because I think it gives it a very nice contrasting element. And so since I had to put my washi in there, I made these little checklists a little bit shorter. This one shorter than that one. Um, the other thing that I did was take these boxes, instead of putting them straight up, like a square, I made them into like a diamond shape. And I wish I had got them more in line but it's not really that noticeable because the one that dips down further is a, a birth for a birthday box and so maybe i can say well that's what i am going to say i dip that one down so it'll be special because that's for my niece's birthday my favorite niece my only niece because i don't do favorites and then what else did i do i put her a less party sticker there for her little birthday she's going to be nine and then I put some quotes in there, and that's that's pretty much it. I really like how this looks. I hope you like it too. Let me know in the comments what you think about the spread. And if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more of my videos, go ahead and hit that red subscription button and the gray notification bell so whenever I do post a new video, you will be notified. It's been real, guys. It's been fun. I hope it's been real fun. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.